Everything is energy. Everything is vibration. From our vast universe to the tiniest atoms in our body. And what we're trying to do is up our thought, up our beliefs, up our emotion to match this perfect vibration. You have an active role in this. See, nothing changes until we do. Nothing. You know, years ago, I decided I'd like to work with people as a personal coach. <laughs> so I was working with this guy one day, and part of his goal was to start working out. So the first week, his task was really simple. He was to investigate three potential workout facilities, gyms, gather pricing, and decide which one he'd like to join. Simple, right? So a week later, during our scheduled time to talk, I asked, so how'd you do last week? We agreed you'd check out a few gyms and decide which one you'd like, uh, which one would work out best for you. After a pause, he said, yeah, I didn't do it. I was like, why? He said, I don't know. I, I just didn't do it. I just wasn't motivated. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> I fired this guy that meeting and actually gave up personal coaching. You know, I couldn't handle the brain damage of spending my time working with people that would not commit, would not change. They wouldn't take the tiniest action to improve their life. Everything in life starts with you. You are 100% responsible for moving your life forward. If you're not moving forward, if you're not taking positive action daily, you're going back. See, we live in an ever-expanding universe. There's constant growth, constant movement, constant expansion. If you're sitting still, you're losing ground. Listen, the law of attraction works. Will you? Don't listen to this podcast and do nothing. Let's cover the basics again and remind ourselves of our piece in this play called life. There are three steps in the law of attraction. Number one, we ask. Now this comes naturally and hopefully intentionally. These rockets of desire we shoot up every day. I want a new relationship. I want more money. I want a better job. I want to open my own company, and on and on. We call these rockets of desire. Secondly, the law of attraction instantly answers our requests. Universal power provides an instant vibrational match to your request. So the third step is we have to raise our vibration retune our radio station to align with this higher vibration. Now, how do we do that? First, we have to know the truth of who we are and the life we deserve. See, you deserve as much goodness and abundance as the richest person in your town. Do you believe that? Do you believe that the perfect relationship is out there? The perfect job, a debt-free life? Now don't worry about how. Let the universe determine that. You need to get your mind straight. Stop the stinking thinking. You can't have thoughts like, I'm only able to make X amount of money because that's what my job pays, or that's all I deserve. You know, you've had these thoughts forever, so put the brakes on those. Start to recognize your limiting thoughts and let them go. We've got to slow these down and stop these limiting thoughts before we're able to plant new thought seeds that support us. Listen, if you're flying down the highway at 75 miles per hour in your Bentley, <laughs> 
Do you believe you deserve a Bentley? You don't just instantly turn and head the other direction. You shift lanes, you slow down, you take the exit ramp, cross over, access the entrance ramp, and build speed. So this is what we have to do with our deep-seated thoughts and beliefs. So when thoughts pop up, be aware and let those negative limiting thoughts go. Let those thoughts that don't support the truth of who you are go. When they pop up, just release them, put the brakes on them, and slowly we'll replace those with the truth of who you are the life you deserve to live. All of this is possible and really relatively simple. You can see this action you'll have to take daily. You, nobody can do this for you. Now, what can speed up this process? Number one, meditation, quieting the mind. Don't tell me you can't do it, that you've tried it and it doesn't work. It works. Listen, if you're not willing to sit and close your eyes for five minutes and follow your breath, your life isn't going to change. You need to tap into this higher power. And we do that by quieting this monkey mind, these incessant thoughts. It's in this quiet space that the universe can provide these new brilliant ideas and opportunities and actions that can bring us to the next level. The second thing is visualization. Envision the life you want to live. After you're done with your meditation, keep your eyes closed. Envision that new boyfriend or girlfriend. Envision that new paycheck and add emotion in your mind live that new life picture it feel it the energy the smells the sounds do this for five minutes each day after your meditation your subconscious that part we're working to retune doesn't know actual events from imaginary it will believe what you imagine to be true and manifest that into your life. Incorporate these habits into your life. We're talking 10 to 15 minutes per day. You'll be absolutely amazed at what will happen to your life in just 30 days. Give this a 30 day test run and prove me true. You have an active role to play in the unfolding of the life of your dreams. Get this scheduled, get to work, be committed, and with consistency, you can manifest anything your heart desires.